welcome back to Adventuring with Amanda. Thank you so much for being here with me and Winston. We are back in Quartzsite after I finally got my driver's side window fixed. A huge shout out to Time Bandit Performance. Christianas took care of me. He got my window all fixed up and so it's in great shape. I have a lot of things on my to-do list for the next week here in Quartzsite. One being I need to clean the residue off of my window, so that's on my list. And we're also going to be doing some fun things this week, like going to Tyson Wells to see the vendors and shop a little bit, um, check out some more restaurants, and even go to a gathering. So let's get started as the fun ramps back up in Quartzsite. We just got to camp, so I haven't put everything up yet, but this is what I'm starting with. Oh, and I just realized I need to put Winston's water back on my rug. It is a beautiful day. The last two days have actually been rainy and cloudy uh, throughout Arizona, actually, but it's a bit breezy. Still beautiful out right now. Winston is relaxing and... I still need to take out my tables, but I have the important things like my dog and my beer all set to go. So I'm not really sure. We might end up moving camp this week. I guess we'll kind of see what happens, but we'll be hanging out with Maddie Van Halen and meeting up with some other people throughout the area. So it's going to be a really exciting week. Since I just got to Quartzsite and it was warmer today and the nights are getting colder, I did open the hood of my van. It helps kind of keep the warmth out so the mice and the rodents will stay away. I also use my Grandpa Gus mouse repellent so it's super potent uh, with peppermint and cinnamon which also helps keep them away. So between those two things and keeping my solar light underneath my van right in front on the strobe effect it manages to keep all the little critters away i did a thing y'all so i brought this electric heater this according to the tag and the label is 1500 watts but i experimented a little bit i ran it about halfway between max and on two and it was drawing about 620 watts concurrently on my 1500 watt power station. So I'm going to experiment with this while I'm here and I will show you the numbers and everything, but I found out that I can actually run this small electric heater in my van on my Van Powers power station if and in, in only if Winston and I get super, super cold, it gets super cold in the van at night, you know, I wake up at three in the morning and I'm freezing. Instead of turning on my van, I can turn this on for, you know, 10, 20 minutes to warm us up. And it really won't draw too much power from my power station. So throughout the week, I'm going to be testing that out and sharing that experiment with you. Here is the residue left on my window from the packing tape I used to hold it up. Now, it is absolutely crucial that you use packing tape when you have an issue like this rather than duct tape because believe it or not, the adhesive is the same strength and the packing tape residue will come off unlike duct tape. So never use duct tape on your windows. You will absolutely highly regret it, but I have a sponge that I'm going to use to take this off with some Dawn dish soap. I'm going to heat up some water, so I use like a warm to hot water, and it'll probably take me about 20 minutes overall to remove it all from my window. It'll give me a project to do this week. Hi, you're so cute. Something else I decided I'm going to do this week is do an updated video on how I've been staying warm in my van because now I have my get out gear down blanket. I also have my heat jacket and I'm going to try out my electric heater. So I will be doing an updated video on how me and kiddo have been staying warm. It has been getting into the thirties in quartzite, but we have been plenty warm. I actually woke up last week and I was even a little bit hot. So I will be creating an updated video for you all to watch on that. It is a gorgeous evening here in Quartzsite. We will have 
a bit chillier temperatures this week. Um, we are expecting, I believe, around 63 and sunny all week. But, I mean, in the sun, 63 is still really beautiful. It'll just be very light winds, uh, a breeze, nothing crazy that's going to make us super cold. So we plan to enjoy a lot of time outside with friends this week and shopping, going into town and having some new experiences. I'm really looking forward to it. What do you see? <laughs> You're so handsome. So I got my new logo made for uh, Adventuring with Amanda. If you guys saw on my community page today, it actually has Winston in it and my rooftop box. I'm going to have stickers made as well as some drink koozies. So if I see you out in Quartzsite this winter, you come to my meetup, you're at Schooly Palooza or the RTR, I will be just handing out my stickers and my drink koozies for fun. I, I'm not sure when they will be done. I don't have them yet because I just sent over the images to the artist this morning to have her do mock-ups for my merch. But I will have them available probably later this month. Y'all, I cannot, I cannot believe what I did. I literally left Buckeye today. I did not pack a jacket or either of my hoodies. Are you serious? I was like so focused on getting other things packed. I didn't pack anything to stay warm, like in terms of clothes on, wow. Like I didn't pack a jacket or a hoodie. So I have my down blanket that turns into a poncho, so that's good. I also brought a long sleeve shirt, kind of sweater type thing, so that's good. But I'm going to have to go into town and purchase something because I literally forgot to pack one. I cannot believe I did that. Well, oh boy. I, I just had a feeling I'd forget something, and I guess that's what it was. Oh, You do want to play. Do you want to play with your reindeer? Go get it. Oh, what happened? You don't want to play now? What happened? Go get it. Go get it for mom. Go get it for mom. I see that tail. Where's your reindeer? Oh, are you handsome? Bring me your toy. Bring me your toy. Should we tell everybody that we'll see them later on our next video? <laughs> Well, everybody, thank you so much for tuning in and hanging out with me and Winston. We will have so much fun content coming for you this week, including my fridge review, which should be posted tomorrow with a 15% off discount code. Thank you all so much for being here. We appreciate you watching. As always, be sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.